hi everyone welcome to my channel my name is jenny and you are in turkey headquarter so today's video i want to talk about queen naomi's um new man that you know people are talking about all over social media yes so that is what um i'm going to talk about on this video and please if today is your first time and you're coming across this video um the man smiling you are seeing on my left side is only of ife only of ileife land the ancient kingdom of ileife land why the woman at my right hand is queen naomi she is the yeyelua of ileife but um last year december she came out to write that she don't want to be referred as a queen anymore and she is now the queen of the people so apparently she is separated with the king now so there has been um a rumor going around social media that she has a new man in her life that she has moved on see this video right here is going to expose a lot of things is going to open a lot of people's eyes because we all remember when all these things started any woman be it even if it's only um family friend cousins anybody like maybe any woman that anybody sees around only of ife people will just tag it only new queen they will say oh the king has gotten a new queen now that is the same thing queen naomi is facing right now you know when all these things started I was like saying, huh, any woman that is close to Oni is now uh, the king's new wife. Hmm, very soon, this thing will reach Queen Naomi. But I was just saying it within myself. But right now, it has started. Like any man, any pastor, any man of God now that people saw with Queen Naomi, they will target Queen Naomi's new man. Now, if you love Queen Naomi and you are always um you are among those people that whenever they see a new a new face or a woman close to Oni, you will target Oni's new girlfriend or new wife. Now see it. They have started it with Queen Naomi. Anybody that is a man, a guy, even if he's a pastor or bishop, anybody now they see around Queen Naomi, as long as the person is not a woman or a lady or a girl, as long as the person is a, a guy, a man, a pastor, anything male that people now see around Queen Naomi, they tag it as is Queen Naomi's new man. See, one thing people don't understand is that even though Queen Naomi, um, when she comes on social media, you understand, she's happy and uh, you know she's living her best life right now but that will not push her to go and you know push her to a new guy immediately no it's not like that as i'm talking to you right now people are still you know talking to them to see if they will come back together even though um the this the chances of them coming back to, together is very very slim but people are still seeing to see if they will come back together so why would Quinomi rush into another man? Quinomi's son is still small. Quinomi's son still need her right now. And we've not even seen where um, Quinomi has gone back to Ife to do the necessary rituals for her to be free to marry another person or to mingle with another person. See, one thing about this culture that a lot of people don't know that Quinomi cannot go to another man right now. Before Quinomi can go to another man, Quinomi must perform all those rituals that she performed when she was entering the palace. Like if you are from Yoruba, you can just correct me if what I'm saying is not true. So people saying that um, she has moved on with another man. No, she has moved on with her life, but not with another man. What is, what is um, happening right now is it's just 50-50 chances of them coming back together. In fact, it's not even up to 50. It's very slim for Queen Naomi to come back to the palace again. So even if Queen Naomi decides today to, you know, to, to get married or to get tangled with another man, 
Pinomi must surely go and do all those rituals that she, she did when they were welcoming her inside the palace. Yes, a lot of people will say that Queen Nomi is a Christian. She will not do it. No. Custom, tradition. Tradition is tradition. Custom is custom. Queen Nomi is a Christian. Yes. Oni is a traditional man. Yes. But yet, they still marry together. So, give caesar what belongs to caesar and to god what belongs to god is even in the bible so i know that queen Naomi, um for her to accept to do that ritual that means she respects people's culture she respects yoruba culture a lot a lot of christians or a lot of women that cause themselves born again and all these things that is a way they understand this born againism of a thing they will not even accept to marry a man that is a traditionalist talk more of a man that is in charge of 201 deities what am i trying to say is a lot of people are saying eh how can a prophetess go and marry um a traditional a, a, a traditionalist like oni like some people are saying eh, well, how can a traditionalist like oni big um deity like oni go and marry a christian no it's not law if you understand tradition very well and you understand christianity and all this they are born again is very well you will not even have that mentality to think about that i know the bible says um um there is no um there is no friendship there is there is a whole difference between light and darkness i know but that same bible still say give to caesar what belongs to caesar and to god what belongs to god so if you decide to follow um if you are if he belongs to god and decide to follow caesar you must accord caesar caesar's respect and accord god god's respect that is it so now that quinomi has pulled out you think a lot of people you think it's easy for queen naomi to pull out one you think it's easy for her to come out and make um, such posts you think it's easy for her to you just move on with another man no it's not done like that in fact only can even move on with other women because he's entitled to marry as many wives i know a lot of people who said what am i saying no see he's the king the tradition made him um so that he can marry as many wives as possible in fact he can marry any wife he wants as long as the person accepts to marry him you understand but we know me that is now the Elua. the Elua, um title is different from you being ordinary olori in the palace that Elua, queen Naomi undergoes a lot of rituals before she became that Elua. so queen Naomi will still um undergone that um she will go through that um rituals again if she's you know not interested in that marriage again so that thing will make it very hard for phenomi to move on with another man again um you we all still remember queen zinab a lot of people said queen zinab has not um done that um call um that rituals they did when she was entering the palace that that was why she's still just on her own up to this moment she's not married yet you think that tradition is easy to do it's not easy so people should stop like when they see a man close to queen naomi they will tag it is queen naomi's boyfriend when they see a man close to only they will say ah is the new wife no that mentality should stop as in male male and female can be can 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 be friends can be family friends it can be anything being the king the king can meet anybody being a lua um, and a prophetess she can meet anybody she can be with anybody you don't know what they're talking about you don't know if is they are preaching or they're talking about what if somebody visits only and maybe the person has some problem to come and discuss with only as as their king just because um the lady is looking um the 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 lady is beautiful you know the way she presents herself everybody will start assuming that oh this is the new queen this is the incoming queen hmm. people should stop thinking like that i believe that if this couple king and the queen are coming back it's just by the special grace of god because right now hmm, hmm, um 
I don't know how they put it um, everywhere they tight for two, both of them. The only thing they need from people is just prayer, encouragement, and let them follow their heart. That is it. So people like trying to tangle them with any woman or any man around them is not nice. It's not nice. Do you think that they don't? They read some comments and they watch videos sometimes. I know you might say they don't have time. Don't worry. They have people that watch it for them and tell them what is happening. So I just made this video to tell you guys that there is no man in Queen Naomi's life right now. So all those um, see the man in Queen Naomi's life. Fa 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 fa. Queen Naomi is not dating anybody right now because people are still hoping um relatives um family friends that see hoping for them to come back even if there is very slim chance of them coming back so even if she wants to move on with another man she must perform that um ritual and if she happened to perform that ritual we will surely hear about it because there's a lot of people in that palace that gives a, a information out about this family you maybe as you're watching this you will not understand a lot of people are domestic workers inside that palace that gives um information of what is happening to their families and friends outside that will get to know about it so you might not understand you might think that oh we don't know what we are saying anyway let me just stop right here so that the video will not be long we'll continue next time thank you so much for watching and i will see you on my next video i love you please stay safe continue to be yourself you know what god loves you bye